Hey, what's up guys? Thanks for joining me for this video. Um, today I'm going to be talking about how to clean up your video footage um, in your goggles. I know this can be a pain, so let's just go through some tips and tricks here that I'm going to try on this quad. First thing is disconnect any wires that you're not using. I had camera control on my camera. This plug goes into my run cam and I had the camera control connected to the flight controller, but I never used it. So I went ahead and removed that wire and I am going to be doing the same thing with um, my VTX. I've actually twisted the ground wire and the signal wire coming from the camera. And the reason I do this is because the ground wire will actually serve as like insulation to the signal wire. Um, so that can, you know, negate any interference from outside components. And I will be doing the same with the VTX cables. And I don't know if you're familiar with these, you might be able to tell that there's usually a blue wire, or you, there's usually four wires in the VTX, and I only have three. And that's because I've removed the smart audio wire, because I don't really use smart audio. With this VTX, you have buttons here on the side that pretty easily accessible so um, I tend to just click on those to change the channel or the power when I need to which isn't very often to be honest um, so that's why I don't use the smart audio wire so that's why I'm not going to keep it connected because that also just gives another instance where noise can get in um, that we don't want so um, let's go ahead and take a look at powering the VTX this guy goes in here like that and then I have pre-tinned the ground wire and the 5 volt 
underneath the VTX. And these are the five, this is the five volt out that I'm gonna be powering the camera with. Um, and also I'm gonna be doing the ground on this, the VTX as well. Uh, if you can't power your camera from the VTX, the next best, best option is to just combine your two ground wires. So you're basically powering everything from the same pad. Uh, sorry, you're grounding everything from the same pad. So what I normally do with VTX is that I can't power my camera from, I'll take the two ground wires, twist them up, tin them, and then I'll place them on a ground pad. Um, that's the next best thing if you can't power directly from the VTX. But in this example, I'm going to be powering directly from the VTX because I can. So this will go here. And I think I'm just going to run them straight across. I think that should be fine. I'm not a huge fan of having these signal wires run so close to this power lead here. I wonder if I can route the wires around here somehow. Okay, so that kind of did work. That keeps the that keeps this signal wire from laying right on top of this power wire, leaving that wire so close to that could actually cause some interference. So here I've just rerouted it around here and using these wires actually worked out pretty good. I guess if you don't have this exact setup, you can kind of use the standoffs to wire, to route the wires around that way to get it out of this, this kind of angle. Um, but this will work for me actually perfectly. What do we got here? Oh yeah, that looks pretty good. Okay, so now that that is all done up, we can go ahead and flip this guy real quick. And grab our camera stuff. And let's go ahead and get those on there. All right, got the five volt in the ground powered up. Now we got, what do we got left? Cam signal, which goes here. Okay, there, that looks pretty good. Hopefully that reaches. All right guys, so I think that's pretty much it. I have, the ground and the power wire to the camera running to the underside of the VTX and then I have the VTX powered to the flight controller. So this theoretically should be giving me some fairly clean footage. All right guys, so this is pretty much it. Let's go through some of the tips that I covered. So first thing, I got rid of any excess wires I wasn't using. So the smart audio wire I got rid of from here and also the cam control out of the camera I got rid of. And then second, I twisted even, I twisted these guys and I twisted these guys. The ground wire will serve as sort of like insulation around the signal, which is pretty nifty, I think. Um, and then what else did we do? We also powered the camera directly from the VTX. The VTX is supposed to have pretty good filtering, so we connected the ground and the power from the camera to the bottom side of the VTX. And if you can't do that, another option is to twist the two ground wires from your camera and the VTX together, tin them, and then place them on basically the same ground pad. We added the capacitor, I've had that. I've put a Havoc capacitor on every single one of my quads. Um, so I'm not really sure what it's like to not have one. 
but I just always use one because better safe than sorry. And I think that's it, guys. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you guys, I don't know, found some of this information kind of useful. I know dealing with bad video feed is really annoying and I've definitely pulled out hair trying to figure out what's going on. Having wires routed correctly is also important. I sort of forgot to mention that and that's why I did this um, little route around here. I didn't want the signal wire going anywhere near this power lead, like black and white rain that will kind of flow through diagonally on the screen. And as you throttle up, it gets worse. That was because I had the signal wire running I think I had a running in between the two power leads. And yeah, I, th I think that's going to do it, guys, for this this little tips and tricks. I'll be doing a few more of these little segments um, as we move forward. Uh, I don't know if you can tell or if you notice there's a different motor on here. And that's going to be um, possibly next the next tips and tricks video. So stick around for that, and you can find out why... There's three Zing motors and one Emacs on here. Hope you guys have a great day. Uh, get out there, fly, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Deuces. Uh, hey guys, one last thing that I forgot to mention. Um, if you guys have one of these, keep them and save them and, and use them <laughs> like this, because it really does help. Uh, it keeps it clean, it keeps the wires from getting rubbed up by the battery strap, and uh, and it looks clean, so um, keep that in mind, guys. Cool. Touch a million, don't ever forget, but we probably forgive my nigga. I'm living, taking the cards that was given. My blessings is already written. Wrap little ribbon, putting ourselves in positions to making some major decisions. I Started from the mud, now you see us going up. Numbers never lie, now you see us blowing up. People used to front, now you see them showing up. Show us up, I've been down and out, but look, look, look. I'm trying to get where I'm going, but haters be trolling, that's why they fucked up. Thinking you got me right where you want me, I tell a ghost just duck.